So, we have seen expression for the displacement for the particle of the for the particle executing SHM. Now, let us find the velocity of the particle having SHM that means simple harmonic motion. So, we have already done this equation y is equal to a sin omega t. We are assuming here the particle is starting its mean position, its motion from the mean position, it means at t equal to 0, it is at mean position. So, we have not included initial, uh, initial phase. Similarly, we can take y is equal to a cos omega t only. So, I am taking just first y is equal to a sin omega t. So, here if you want to get velocity, you have to differentiate it with respect to time. So, we can write to, uh, v is equal to d y upon d t is equal to a omega cos omega t. So, differentiation of sin omega t with respect to time is omega cos omega t. We can write here v is equal to a omega in place of cos omega t we can write here 1 minus sin square omega t that is a sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 I have used. And we know it sin omega t is equal to y upon a. So, we can write here. So, we will be getting v is equal to a omega under root of 1 minus y square upon a square and we will be getting a square take here and will be coming out. So, we will be getting omega under root of a square minus y square. So, this is expression for the velocity. So, now see in this expression v is equal to omega a square minus y square if you are taking. So, we can write here v is equal to omega under root of a square minus y square. If you are taking y is equal to 0, it means the particle is at mean position, displacement is 0 means we can write v is equal to omega that is a maximum velocity here we can take. And when we are taking here y is equal to a that is at extreme position as we have done in the circle that is the pos at position b or at d. So, when the particle is at extreme position displacement is equal to amplitude and we can write here velocity is equal to 0. So, this is called amplitude of velocity when the particle is at mean position it has got maximum velocity and when the particle is at extreme position particle has got 0 velocity. 